You say that this is a ploy to keep young people from building wealth from the get-go and be stuck with a lifetime of debt. Can you speak to this and explain how this is a common lie and how this keeps young people from building wealth in a way that no previous generation has had? What we've had happen in the United States is absolutely disgusting. They are transferring wealth from teenagers, in many cases, to colleges and their administrators. And the idea that you go to some mediocre school and for four years it costs $320,000 and you're going to get a $60,000 job at the end of that, that math doesn't make sense in any universe. When you then have that coming out into the workforce, your balance sheet is wrecked. How are you going to be able to buy a house and start a life and do those things?